Hi everyone and welcome to a video demonstration of the OrCam My Eye. The OrCam My Eye is a technologically advanced device unique in its ability to provide visual aid through a discrete wearable platform and simple, easy to use interface, which serves to enhance the daily lives and provide more independence to those with blindness or low vision. The small portable device has a camera that has optical character recognition technology and is designed to fit in the wearer's pocket. The system discreetly clips onto the wearer's glasses with a small magnet that can attach to any pair of glasses frames, excluding some wire frames if they are a little too thin. Turning the device on and off is a breeze with a single button that is placed on the interior magnetic side of the device. To turn on, take the OrCam off of your glasses to access the button on the back side. Hold the button for three seconds and a small blue light will show up on the front side as the device turns on for about 90 seconds. Emitting chirps until it begins to speak, the device will let you know when it's ready to use. To turn off the device, you press the back side button once. The OrCam will say suspending. Please press again to shut down. Suspending. Press again to shut down. Shutting down. Please wait. If you want your device to stay on standby, meaning it is asleep rather than off, you can leave it suspended by not pressing the button again. If you'd like to turn the device off, Press the button again immediately after it says suspending. It should then say shutting down and turn itself off. Suspending. Press again to shut down. Shutting down. Please wait. The OrCam speaker can either be loud enough for those within the room to hear or soft enough for only those next to you to hear. In addition, Bluetooth headphones or speakers can be connected to the device for private, or public listening. To raise and lower the volume of the device, you swipe the flat of your finger alongside the outside as it rests on your glasses frame. Swiping your finger from the back to the front of your device, your ear to your eye, will raise the volume. Swiping your finger from the front to the back, your eye to your ear, will lower the volume. Volume up. Volume down. There are two methods of capturing text with the OrCam device. The first is capturing a full page of text. If you want to know what is on a full page, take a photo by tapping the side with the flat of your finger once. Marie Curie was a Polish unnaturalized French physicist and chemist who conducted pioneering research on radioactivity. She was the first woman. This method of taking photos can read anything and everything that is printed text that is in front of you, from a reasonable distance and with a 70 degree field of vision. This means that your device can read a poster in front of you or even grocery store aisle signs. Our second method of capturing text is for reading specific areas of text. You can do this by pointing your index finger at your text. Your nail bed must be shown to your device as this is how it detects where the finger is pointed to. Once you have placed your index finger parallel to your text, with the flat of your finger against the page, you hold it in place until you hear an initial chirp. Once you hear the sound, keep looking at your text, but remove your index finger. Another chirp will sound, signaling that the full photo of our text was taken. She was born in Warsaw, in what was then the Kingdom of Poland, part of the Russian Empire. She studied at Warsaw's clandestine. Once the OrCam begins reading to you, you no longer have to look at or hold your text and can place it down. While it's reading to you, you no longer have functionality of raising and lowering the volume by swiping your finger along the side of the device. Instead, this action will fast forward in your text rather than raising the volume, or rewind in your text rather than lowering the volume. The first of the Curie family legacy of five Nobel. She was the first woman to win a Nobel Prize. The first person and the only woman to win. The latest feature to the OrCam is the ability to identify and read tables. This feature is one of the most difficult things to accomplish as an OCR device, so it's sure to grow into a stronger feature as time moves on. 
To accomplish table reading, you simply have to take a full page photo of your table, and it should automatically identify and read the table, reading row by row. This can help users better understand documents such as receipts or restaurant menus that have table-like formats. Identifying products and banknotes is as easy as it gets. For these features, the OrCam only needs to have the barcode or the banknote within its view for a couple of seconds. Should it recognize either of these two things, it will read the product name and quantity of the banknote value aloud. The OrCam can identify faces that are added to the device with the ability to add up to 150 faces. Please name the person in front of you after the beep. Patrick. It can also identify colors through a pointing gesture with your index finger. Purple blue area. If you're not certain which OrCam features and model are right for you, please reach out to your assistive technologist. This has been a video demonstration of the OrCam My Eye device. Thank you for joining us.